Hi friends, today I'm going to show you how you can implement that text inside the check time software for any salary. You can plus or minus any text inside the check time software using wages function. You go to wages, we choose one employee, you go to setting, all employee. I just take one employee for sample. So this employee have 2000 salary, $5. Dollar, ten dollar, and twenty dollar is overtime. Normal rest day and public holiday. This is the area group where we going to put the tax. Then first we go to allowance and deduct. You enter your tax name here. I enter a tax A. Any code for the tax. And choose recruiting. And how many percentage? Five percent, ten percent. And choose here percent. Then save. So this will be add plus inside the salary. If you want to deduct from the salary any tax, then we go to deduction. Then type the name. I type here tax B code, any of the code and recurring same. How many percent you want to deduct from the salary? 10% percentage save. So I have here two things. 5% is add inside the salary. 10% is deduct from salary. Now I create a one group. I just put here any name you can put here. I just put a text A and code I just put a sample A text A and I add here this is 5% will be add inside the salary. Deduction will be deduct from the salary. Okay. So you can see here. So after this save and I create one more group which is only deduct from the salary. I put some name just only a random name anything this will I choose only deduction tax so I just write here tax B tax B okay so we choose here deduct because we want to only deduct from the salary done then save now we go back to the employee profile same setting select the employee who and we go to the employee name i just minus any old setting here then we just go to plus select the text which text you want to give to employee select this is the text okay now save so right now we have tax b which is deducting only from the salary now we go to normal process get attendance first this will be get the attendance detail and for which month and which year you want to process you can select the year and select the month process so this will be process salary then we go out then we go to very verify one time if anything you can edit here while the by verifying okay select the month okay you can edit here if something you want then we just go out from here then we go to salary calculation we select the year we select the employee whoever you have selected query then in case you want to edit something you can click the edit button you can edit something from here right now we have this one text is already showing you how much is text will be going to deduct from the salary then we verify once you verify then you are this employee is ready and after this you can go to the month end view so just click the month end once you done click admin now whatever your password enter the password then we go to print the salary slip you can go to past payroll anything you want to if you wrongly process you can delete from here okay then you have delete button here but we are not, not going to delete we just select the year select the employee who and we go here you can see the salary slip 
so this is our salary slip here you can see total earning is 2758.36 275.84 is deducted so net salary is 2482.53 so this is how you can go So you can see this is the salary slip we have you can see the deducted amount here we have this is the tax b just now we created deduct how many percent is uh, 10 percent deducting 2758.36 from this amount will be deducted and we have final net salary is here so this this we are deducting the tax from the salary okay in case you want to plus the tax inside the salary that i show you now we just have to i have to delete first the old payroll which i process i fast forward the video and delete all this process we can go back to the employee so we go to the employee now it's like the employee same right now we just delete this old tax rule from here one group and we choose the another group this have deduction and plus both 5% adding inside the salary 10% deducting from the salary so we do same process I fast forward the video here get attendance everything So salary calculation you can see here you already once you query you can edit and you can see how much percent is deducted how many percent is added inside the salary okay five percent is add ten percent deduction verify done then we go to the month end same process and month end admin so verify what is your password you can put same password so just we go to the print salary slip select month and select year print the salary slip so this is our salary slip right now you can see here first is we have the tax a okay first we have here this is complete salary slip our first step we have here tax a and tax b so this is the tax A is plus inside the salary. So total become this one. Okay. Then after this, this will be deduct from the salary and total become this one net salary. So this is how your tax is defined. You can choose here whichever you want. You want deduct or you want to add is up to you. Adding tax inside allowance deducting inside the deduction so this is the total how you going to implement the tax inside the system